We've been trying to hang a chandelier, and I've hung... Another chandelier for your wife? Chandelier. I've hung 20 chandeliers in the last 20-some years. Because you're married to me. Married to you, right? And we do chandeliers a lot. And I went to a lamp store today because we had this problem with the bracket. You hung that chandelier. Huh? You hung that chandelier. Above me. I'm just being weird. So I went to the lamp store and I knew that what I needed was this thing, which is called a hickey, otherwise known as a doohickey. <laughs> but it's actually called a hickey and it allows you because I had no space. Who, above. Came, who came up with the names I for all these lamp parts? I because don't, I don't know, but <laughs> when I searched for this on the internet, <laughs> When I search for nipple and hickey, <laughs> which this is the nipple, right? I search for that on YouTube. You don't want to know what I came up with, okay? So, but I had to search. I had to search for the. I got the that part here. I went to a lamp store, and so by using this hickey, okay, it allows the wires the do from the ceiling. The do hickey. Let's call it a do hickey. It's actually called a hickey. From the ceiling fixture to go around, it doesn't have to go through the nipple. And so the the chandelier wires can come up through this hole and they can actually be tied off outside of the nipple. Does which... this mean that um, we can install the chandelier with fewer swear words I than normal? So. Although we'll be using the words hickey and nipple a lot. <laughs> But I went to this. This is a family channel, to, you know. I know. I went to this lamp store called Artisan Lamps, which apparently has been in town for 40 years, and I never knew it was there. But I went in there, and a very nice man went, and I showed him what I needed, told him I needed a hickey, and he didn't make any jokes or anything. And he went to a box of stuff, a box of old parts, probably 40-year-old box. It had rust. It had all kinds of stuff in this box. That's my kind of store. And he found a 1 slash 8, a 1 eighth to 1 eighth hickey. These are usually are used to change the different sizes of nipples from the fixture to cross crossbar to the chandelier um, because the Video. pieces and parts that come with the lights never, never match up with they what's in the house. What you have in the house. So in this case, I knew exactly what I needed, a 1 8 to 1 8 hickey that wasn't large. So in this case, uh, this was exactly what I needed. He didn't charge me anything for it, and all of his advice was free, which I thought was great. So and if you get that chandelier hung up, that room will be finished. Okay. Well, that'll be good. So that's our task for tonight, is to hang this doohickey up with the chandelier okay so off we go off we go okay jesse jesse this is pretty hilarious you you're you're so talented <laughs> oh it's not too bad down here but but that's <laughs> okie dokie oh dear Jessie did not get the memo that it's Monday morning and she has to go to school. The bus is going to be here in five minutes, sweetie. Can you manage? I hate to take you out in the cold. You look so comfortable in there. But it's time for school. Okay, can no. I have this? No, no. No, I can't have it. I don't blame you. Oh my goodness. I wish I could just leave you there. You look so comfortable. All right, Mom's going to turn off the camera because it's going to take all eight arms to get you on the bus this morning, I think. There you are. I saw a big basket of clothing in the foyer, so I figured you were still here. Yeah. What are you doing there, David? Uh, eating cinnamon rolls. <laughs> Little mini bite-sized evil cinnamon rolls. Oh, yeah. Your father buys those little bite-sized things and they're the most evil things on the planet because guess what happens? Mm. 
your mother walks past them and eats them all day long. Yeah. Yeah. Is it a little early for you there, dude? A little bit. Yeah? Can you manage? Hopefully. I hope so, too. Are you still here, Hannah? Yep. You're waiting for your ride, are you? Yep, I am. Yeah. So what's up with your ride this morning? It got canceled because of today. The all, sub all subscription a trip. All subscription trips, I'm sorry. Um, are, are have been canceled due to today. Oh, because it's a federal holiday. Yeah. Oh, so your dear old dad's got to take you to work, huh? Yeah. Yeah, so your window is exactly 7.15 today. <laughs> <laughs> There's no 30-minute window. He'll be rolling down those stairs pretty soon in his pajamas, I think. <laughs> <laughs> it's Monday, baby. Thank I God. think you're the only person in the whole house who's happy about that. Yes! Yeah, I had to apologize to Jesse oh. for it being Monday. Oh, yeah. She was a sleeping girl. I better um, stop this and take Mr. Arnie out because <laughs> he woke up finally. Uh. Okay, I'm going to do that. I thought you would come downstairs in your pajamas because no. it's oh dark 30. No. And you have to play taxi driver today. I do because it's a holiday. Well, it's for Veterans Day. Some it's a people. holiday for some people. So Hannah's paratransit trips do not run on the holiday. So I got to take her, and uh, David's going back to college. Yep. So because uh, it's Monday. Because it's Monday, we got to get up and get uh, get going. And I'm uh, I still have a full day of work ahead of me. So yes, you do. You're waiting for your ride, Hannah. I am. Mm hmm. Do you have a window? Uh, 715. <laughs> <laughs> and not, a, not a minute more? No. Because if it's 716, <laughs> I start to freak out. Oh. Yeah. Usually my ride is 645 to 715, but now it's just 715 because Metro Access decided to cancel subscription trips today. Uh oh! Uh-oh! Ruh -ro. David, what are we going to do with her? <laughs> Did you get your um, warm hoodie? Is that your warm one? Yeah. Okay. Because we know how you are. You are a cold weather weenie. Pretty much. Pretty much. <laughs> Arnie, I'm afraid to ask what you're doing in there. He's just wanting to hang around with you guys. I want you to say hi to him. He's not going to see you for a whole week. He loves you, David. He says, Davy, don't go. Don't go. Take me with you. Everybody can see Arnie's new vest, his new uh, harness. It seems to be working a whole... He doesn't like it too much, but it seems to be working a lot better, doesn't it, David? You haven't walked him yet, but he's not pulling near as hard, and when he does, I don't feel as bad about it. So it is working. He's finally big enough that we were able to get him one. No offense, Mom, but I do not want to walk him. Nobody expects you to, Hannah. It's fine. Mm-hmm. <laughs> he wants to. He wants to go with you guys. Uh, no. And besides, I don't think they would let me in the kitchen with dog hair on my face. I don't think they would. <laughs> they would tell me to brush it off with a lip roller or something. So what you got in there, Davey? Oh, it looks like good stuff. Ew. Clean skivvies. And he just wants me to feed him again. Yeah, Once is not enough. Twice is not enough. Three times is not enough. You ready to go get in the car, Hannah? I am. All right, let's roll. David, yeah. can you bring your stuff? Yeah. All right, off we go. Yeah.
to another independent day. Yep. I'll open the first. Is it it's open already. It's open already. Bye. Bye. Bye, Dad. Bye. Are you bundled up enough, David? Yep, I think so. It's only going to be 67 degrees today, but, you know. Okay. What is it, Hannah? 64. It's going to be 64? All right, guys, mom's going to go back in where it's warm. Have a good day. Okay, love you, Davey. See you in a week or two, whenever you decide to. Yes, that, I was going to say that, but I decided to be nice. No, I got to do it. I got to move all my tools. Oh, I know. I gotta get my... He almost whacked me. You got to get what? I got to get my backpack. Oh, that would help. I knew I was forgetting something. Oh, all right, did you find your backpack finally? Okay, I love you. It's only been like... Have a good week. You too. Oh. Oh. Kiss your mother. Okay. See you later. Bye-bye. All right. All right. Love you. Okay. Who else sees the alien on my ceiling? Anyone? You know the cloud formation thing? Well, this is a reflection from my dirty dishes in the sink. And it looks like there's an alien on my ceiling. <laughs> Let me know in the comments below if you see the alien. Then by alien, I mean the extraterrestrial. <laughs> oh my goodness. E.T. Phone home.